FIFA World Cup is out and EA have released so much content and you feel overwhelmed. Well, let me tell you, there's a way for you to complete all of these objectives in just two games. So this is how you're going to do it. You need to score one goal with every single nation that is going to the World Cup. The one nation everyone's having problems with, this Qatar nation that is not in the game. So you have to find a way of getting yourself a Qatar player. When you first log on to the game, they give you an option of picking a country. Many people are making the mistakes of going for their favorite country. The easiest fix to this is to pick Qatar. If you've already picked Qatar and it is too late, there is a fix and I'll show you how to do this. First chance you got is in the season progress. So level one, you get a five World Cup players pack. I've claimed mine, but not opened yet. So I'm going to open it and hope to pack a Qatar player. Now, if you don't get anything from there, we haven't opened the archers yet. You can go over to the moments section, go to start gallery and over here for 10 stars. I know we all thought the moments was useless. You can actually buy yourself a group A and B FIFA player pack that contain 10 players and hope that you can get yourself a little Qatar one. So we're going to redeem that. It's opening. I thought I was going to go to my store, I'm getting an English striker. Is it going to be good? Tammy Abraham. Doesn't matter. We're just looking for a Qatar player. Come on. Save me. Save me. Oh, I don't think so. I don't think I got one, did I? Ecuador, Wales, USA. I don't see one here. My God. Let us open this five World Cup players pack. Come on. Just hope for a Qatari player, man. I don't care about anything else. We're still going to see English left wing. Who is that? Phil Foden. Not bad. Building a nice little English squad here. But, but what's in it? What's in it? No Qatar player once again. If you're like me and you missed out on the both two packs, there's one last thing. It's this objective right here in the, under the FIFA World Cup Swaps Showcase 1. Assist 7 goals with a through ball using any Japanese player. So I'm going to do that right now. We're going to come back and see how we do. All right, so this is the team I'm going to be using. I'm going to be doing multiple objectives at once here. I'm doing some of the foundations at the same time. But I will be subbing on these two Japanese players when the game starts and looking for them to get seven assists in one game because we don't want to play any more games than we have to. Let's get into this, and I'll be back once I've completed it. Little tip, boys. Once you got the assist with your Japanese player, you can actually do this right here. You just got to do a ball rolls at the center circle like this with a defender, and usually they won't tackle you, so it prevents you from having to play the whole game. Okay, completed the match. Just doing ball rolls. We got the seven assists. Let's check here to make sure. Yep. And we got seven with one just to make sure if I had to be with one player. Let's claim this. Let's go see if we can pack one from this. Okay. So we did. We got it. Let's claim it. We got a swaps token as well. But that doesn't matter to us. All we want is to get a Qatar player in our pack. Send us to the club. Once it loads. There it is. Group A essentials. We got four players. Come on. Come on, please, man. Just show me Qatar. I don't care about anything else. Netherlands, left back, Malasia. Anything else? It's taking a sweet time. Oh my goodness, my luck is just not there. So guys, we missed on all three opportunities that we had. I am not about to put two tokens into this guy. So I'll show you guys how to do everyone else and hopefully you guys have better luck than me and you can get a Qatar player. But this is how you do it now. The best way to go about this Hopefully you've succeeded and you haven't failed miserably like me. So make two squads with 16 nations. You have 11 different nations on the field and then five different nations on the bench because you can make five subs. Then what you want to do is have a paper, some kind of spreadsheet or something where you cross off whenever you score with that nation. So you don't waste your time and you score again. Okay, you got your two teams ready. You got your spreadsheet, your piece of paper with the nations down. What you want to do next is go into a beginner match in squad battles because it can be done in every game mode possible. Next, you want to score with any player. Make sure you don't have a goalie in net because you have to score with him as well. And then once you've done scoring with the full starting 11, you want to make five subs and bring your bench on and score with them. You want to do that twice. Obviously, one with this team and one with the other team. And you'll be complete all of the objectives in 30 minutes. I'm going to go do it now to show you guys how easy it is and that you truly can do it all in two games. Okay, once I score here with the keeper, it's going to be 11 goals. And I'm going to make my subs and score five more goals. And then we'll be done. Scratch that off my list. Let's make some subs now. Take off five players. Just going to double check here that everyone has scored a goal. And indeed they have. So we've made our five subs. Let's score five more goals. And then you can just put your controller down because it is beginner and they won't attack you. There we go. We scored with the keeper. We put our controller down. 
and then we go into the next game and do the exact same thing first 16 are in the books let's get into the next set and get this over with got our second team loaded with all the different nations let's see how we can do there we go just like last game we're all done now obviously this game only scored 15 because i'm missing qatar still so now we put the controller down and wait for the game to finish all right second game is now done let's go see how we did did we complete all the objectives in two games all it took was two games to complete all of these objectives we couldn't get the qatar because our pack click was awful we tried to get him hopefully ea releases some more packs so we can get a qatar player and complete the objective our only hope is to maybe get one out of this 80 plus three world cup players if you guys enjoyed the video leave it a like subscribe and i'll catch you guys next time peace